Hey everybody, uh, today we're back to Avis Padlocks. This is the 65AL40. It is uh, now part of their Titanium line, but uh, that AL suffix leads me to believe that it actually predates the, suffi uh, the Titanium branding. But really in all respects, it is pretty much the same as an, any other or most other Titanium padlocks, just a little bit smaller. Uh, even the keys look like slightly smaller versions of each other. Uh, now the interesting thing about this compared to a lot of their other solid body padlocks, even their brass ones, is that this uh, has five pins instead of just four, like a lot of the others in this uh, size will have. So we're going to lock this up and try to pick it open. Now first thing to do when you're trying to attack one of these is get the right tension tool because this keyway doesn't give you a lot of places where you can get a tool in without really interfering with your uh, pick but the uh, medium sized non serrated tool out of Peterson's flat 5 set does fit pretty nicely in that uh, little cut near the pins so we're gonna get in there and we're gonna feel around, try to find a binding pin. When you find a binding pin in this, because of the size of the keyway and the design of it, those the ends of those pins fit close enough to this little shelf that my tool is resting on that uh, it can be tricky getting your pick under the uh, the pin that you are trying to uh, set. But you just have to persevere, keep going, and if you angle it around, you can usually get under there. But don't be tempted to try to drop your tool into uh, this trench closer to the edge because you're never going to be able to reach your uh, pins that way. Every time the camera's off, I can get this done in like a minute. But now, as soon as I've got it on camera for you folks, or for the one person who watches any of my videos, aside from myself. Oh, oh there we go. Now, this does have a pretty strong uh, spring tension. That's designed to make it more difficult for us pickers because it means that we have to try putting a lot more tension on it than we normally do or really want to, but we've got that open. You can see it's uh, Abus's usual unshimmable uh, latch. It's not a ball bearing. Now, theoretically, these are shimmable, but uh, the tolerances are awfully tight in there so I haven't even tried to fit one into this it's just so tight but not a bad uh, little lock if you want uh, something that's difficult to pick five pins paracentric uh, keyway very short and tight really uh, keeps you on your toes happy picking and stay safe everyone